So there is this image of a black hole. Today I'll be recreating this as a moving visual. We start by adding in a circle. Change the resolution to 1920 by 1080. Set this circle to 0 0.15 radius. Then take an edge. Uh, set this to 61.5. And the other one also 61.5. Now we change the color to 0 0.043. 0 0.0121 and 0. This is really dark now, but we're going to get some color out of this. Now we displace this with a noise. Set the resolution to 1920 by 1080. Set the transform translate to ABS time dot seconds divided by 15. This will make the noise move. Now Turn monochrome off and set the harmonics to 7. Uh, connect this up and set the displace weight to 0 0.02. Add a transform uh, and type in abs time dot seconds. Uh, this will rotate it just a little bit. Now press Alt N to get a null. Uh, connect a feedback, a transform a level and a composite. Connect this null to the composite. Drag this composite onto the feedback. Uh, set the operation for the composite to add uh, and add in a keyboard in and reference this to the pulse of the feedback. Now we can reset our feedback loop. Go to the transform and set the scale to 1.002 and set the brightness of the level to 0.96. Select the composite, press Alt N. Now select the entire feedback loop and right click and say collapse selected. Now we can give this a name, feedback loop, and we can copy it. We can go in here and change the transform to 0.997. Change the level to 0 0.97 and insert a composite here. Add this and change the operation to add. Now we can display this. Insert a blur. Set the pre shrink to 8 and the filter size to 13. Grab the feedback loop, copy it, disconnect this, uh, connect it, and fill it in go in here and set the level to 0 0.43 and set the transform to 1 and 1 add in an rgb key and a level set the contrast to 1.25 now to make it a bit more interesting add an lfo set the frequency to 0 0.05 Connect a math, set the range to from minus one to one to 0 0.05, 0 0.15. Connect this to the radius and now it grows and shrinks. If we disable the blur, we get a more detailed version, but obviously the image that was taken from black hole was really blurry. so. I'm going to leave that on. Please check out my Patreon if you want to download this file. That's all I've got for you today. Thanks for watching.